Welcome back to yet another video. This is one day after last video. It is January 3rd and there are still some birds working off the beach and we're gonna head out, hopefully not too far, and get on some bass. So we're gonna see how we do. Stay tuned. bait around. It looks really good further up, but I'm not going to pass this up just yet. They're doing something. Hopefully we can get over some bass. I'm marking plenty of bait. Just to see. Oh wow! Tons of fish straight down. Look at that. Tons and tons and tons straight down there. Just want to load them. That's unfortunate. There we go, yes! Hooked up, finally, on the first fish. Let's go, baby. Oh, that feels amazing. Yes! Drove about 30 minutes south just looking for these things, and finally got my first fish hooked up. Freezing cold out here. Man, this is rewarding. Ah, oh, yes! wanted that guy. Let's see. Hopefully you guys can see me just a little bit. There we go. This guy's got a little bit of sea lice on him, but we'll take it. Nice bass for January. Let's release him. Sick. Let's see if we can get some more. We're in so many fish right now, I don't want to be wasting time here. Okay. Let's see if we can get another slow roll. Oh, here we go. Got him. <laughs> so sick. There we go. Next cast. The screen is lit up. Oh, yeah. Yes. Oh, okay. Another nice one.
just gonna drop the spoon right down on the bottom. Oh, wow. So many wind knots. Yeah, that's not coming out. Switch them back to the bait caster. Not good. I don't know how I did that. It's hard to get these clips in there because they're not really meant for that sort of thing. Still marking fish. Hopefully we get one. Shut the engine off. I don't have a lot of gas. Fish on. First cast on the bait caster. Good thing I switched up quickly. What do I've got this guy? This is a tiny one though. Look how small he is. Sick. Kill buddy, relax. That was what he wanted. There we go. Got another cast. I'm not really marking them anymore. The birds kind of moved on a little bit. Eat it. Eat it. Dang it. There's a couple of bass on that one. Yep. Should get that here. I need some lessons. Switching to pair of gloves number three. He's got wet because they have holes in them. And my other ones just aren't meant for fishing. I'm gonna crank this guy in really quick. Oh, there we go, fish. That one was pretty deep. I think this is number four. Just swing him on in. There you go. You guys can see it on the big camera. NLDM. Fourth fish of the day. Gotta love it. Seems that we drifted off a little. Crazy, just eat it. This is insane. You're gonna be right here. I don't know how I didn't hook one there. We're marking so many. I suck. There we go. Got him finally. After seven swings, seven misses, got another fish. Tiny guys, that explains a lot. Another one? Bite. 
I what I should have done and I wasn't thinking was dropped it straight to the bottom because I could have reeled it through so many more fish. Rather than just skimming the top of these things. Those birds that are working up there. So I just fixed up my spinning rod. We got this bad boy on. These fish are breaking the surface, so I'm gonna try to throw this around for some fun. I have a dock that has singles on it, but these fish are so small, so I'm thinking trebles are gonna be better. So we're gonna drive over back that way to the birds and keep fishing. Bring that swim bait up there. Oh, they're blowing up. Alrighty. Another wind knot? Are you kidding me? I just retied and I already have a wind knot. This one isn't coming out. This is actually pathetic. Oh, I just got it. I just got it. Wait, let's see if I can get one on the hand line. They're on it. They're on it. Oh, got one on the hand line. <laughs> I got one on the hand line, baby. He's got my dock, so. <laughs> I hope I got that blow up on camera. That, this has never happened to me. Top water hand line fish. Don't want him to cut through my hands. Oh, he's trying to run. <laughs> this is the first time this has ever happened. Striper just came up and ate it. Oh, he sideswiped it. That's so funny. Try to eat it and got hooked in the back. There he goes. First fish I've ever got on a hand line and on top water. Top water hand line, baby. This is a mess. I literally just tied a fresh FG knot and I'm already dealing with this. They're blowing up everywhere. Now we're gonna just whip this guy out. Going back to Old Faithful. I haven't caught a bass in a while. Oh, there you go. Right as I said it. This is all they want today. It's all they want, this five inch. The colors on them are so cool. Sick. up right there. He's got bump, bumpy down. Oh. 
No way. What did you do to my tail? You made me hook my tail. Finally. Little guy. That's a fat one. He's got a little stomach on him. Not super fat, but he is fat. Hopefully that explains why I'm missing so many fish. Oh, my just got hit right here. Right here, right at the boat. Sick. That was so cool. He just, he just was like dead weight. Just sat down on it. Not a bad one. Whoa. Here he goes. Now he's waking up. It's too late. I already got him to the boat. Yes, sir. Whoa. Ha <laughs> ha. That's a good one. Well, that is it for today. There's still a few birds around. I'm getting tired though, and I got a long way home. So we're gonna make the run back. But today I was using this Tranks 300, 30 pound braid, seven foot six, Dio Proteus, and then 30 pound Fluoro. You don't need Fluoro, but I just had it, so I used it. 30 pound Fluoro, and then this clip, and then a five inch swim bait. And this was the ticket. Super sick, super fun day. Gonna start driving back, so thank you guys for watching, and I will see you next time. Peace.